Need stop. Need stop. Hi there, Scary Gary. I'm glad you came back for another week. Today we're going to do a neat stuff on RV screen doors. Like they have this little, I think it's Campco has it. You can get it on Amazon, 15 bucks. It's it's very, very inexpensive. A little bar screen that you can basically put on your screen door. Because the screen doors on RVs, like everything else they're trying to save weight, they're pretty flimsy. And I've seen people that have had dogs, kids, themselves put their hands straight through the screen when they're trying to close it. And it just, it, it basically, this bar, if it does one thing alone, it makes the screen a little more stable. The other thing is it gives you a place you can actually grab the screen and you can shut it and open it and nut it, open it and shut it. And it, it just makes it a lot nicer. And it's very, very simple to install. It's basically, it's got two sides and a handle in the middle of it. You have to decide, and they have a template in the box, And but I, you know, we don't, men don't use templates, you know that. So I just basically placed it up there, figured out where it needed to hit the screen. And it is kind of critical where you put those screws through because you don't want those screws to be in an area that you may have to change the screen out later or they're going to affect the opening and closing of it. So you want to make sure they're at that specific edge. And I fit it in there. I set one side, then I adjusted the measurement, and then I actually set the other side. When I say set, it's just a matter of screwing in a little screw that inserts in one end and inserts in the other uh, other side and then your bar doesn't slide in the middle then it's just a matter of figuring out on the door where you're going to put it and then screwing through it or drilling through it and then screwing on there do it the other side making sure it's level and screwing that side in and then there's just two other screws at the bottom so i mean it's 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 very simple to do and the door ends up being so, so much sturdier it's, it's able you can grab it you can move it in and out now the original loretta and loretta 2o we have a front door and we have a back door which is kind of the door that goes into the bathroom and you might think oh I don't use that door that often or just come in this way and things like this but I ended up for 15 bucks I went ahead and got two of them and I put one on the bathroom now it does cut into the size of your bathroom just you know a little bit comes in this way and the one thing that it that made my mind up I was going to do it back there besides the advantages of having it open and close making the door sturdier it is also a great place to hang a towel which you know in RVs I mean we like to basically hang our towels up and hopefully use them more than once um, as long as we do a good enough job in the shower and so we don't have to continue to go to the laundromat or wash and so it just gives you one other place to hang up because there's only one other towel holder in this trailer. So do it on the other side. It, it uh, does good. So, well, I know this is a quick one, but it was a very easy and it is something that any, I think almost anybody can do. And it just is a way, it's not gonna add much more weight to your trailer, but it's going to make it a lot simpler to open and shut your doors. So I hope you've enjoyed, and I sure hope to see you next week. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Turn on your post notifications. Click the comments down below. Subscribe and you'll make me happy. <laughs>